Let's all go to the movies. Let's all go to the movies. Let's all go to the movies and have ourselves some fun. Let's go. Good morning, movie mom, and happy weekend. Happy weekend to you. Not a ton of stuff going on at the theater this weekend, but we got some stuff to talk about. Are you guys fans of the classic movie Dazed and Confused? A million years ago, because I was Dazed and Confused when it came out. <laughs> I'm not sure if my parents watch, let me watch that one yet. <laughs> Dazed and Confused, of course, is the ultimate ode to 1970s, basically sex, drugs, and rock and roll from Richard Linklater, the guy who later went on to do School of Rock and Boyhood. People have been asking him what happened to all those high schoolers back in the 70s, and he has come up with what he calls a spiritual sequel, which just like Days and Confused, named after a rock song. It's called Everybody Wants Some, two exclamation points from Van Halen. And once again, it's got a fabulous soundtrack. And once again, it's about sex, drugs, rock and roll, except now it's 1980. A lot of what were we thinking with that facial hair? I thought it was a movie that while I was watching it, I was going, well, this is a very pleasant movie. Not much is happening. But afterward, it really stayed with me because there were some very thoughtful points that it made about what happens when you were the number one baseball player in your town and then you go to college and everybody there was the number one baseball player. So it's got some good stuff in it. Also, just like the first one, a great cast of kids who probably will break out and become big stars, especially Wyatt Russell, the son of Goldie Hawn and Kurt Russell. We've got it in the jeans. I had a fun time uh, interviewing him, too. Also this week, we've got a good, smart thriller called Midnight Special with Michael Shannon. He plays the father of a little boy who's got... We don't really find out until much later in the movie. There's something special about him. And because he's special, people are trying to hunt him down. There's a religious group that thinks that he is maybe the savior or an angel, and and then the uh, government wants him, too, because, I don't know, maybe he's a weapon. Maybe he's, I don't know, we should, maybe he's invading. We don't know. Father's trying to protect him from both. Smart movie, well done. Good, solid thriller. So uh, that one is called Midnight Special. Okay, on DVD and Blu-ray, we have Concussion with uh, Will Smith in the real-life story of the doctor who broke the story about the NFL's efforts to cover up the brain injuries for their players. Could not be more timely. The Hateful Eight super-duper violent movie from Quentin Tarantino. It's Point Break, a super pointless remake of a classic film with Keanu Reeves. What are they thinking? And then, just to make everybody's day, it's not on DVD till next week, but it starts streaming today. Star Wars! <laughs> this is how bad it is. I, I want both, so I'm going to get the streaming and the Blu-ray next week. I'm with you, brother. Already done it. Already watched it. Extras are amazing. Oh, okay. I mean, I love that movie more every time I watch it. I can't wait till the next one this winter. The one that it happens before the Death Star blows up. I'm beside myself. Oh. Okay, now, next week... <laughs> I feel like I should have a tranquilizer gun. <laughs> <laughs> next week, we got a new Melissa McCarthy comedy called The Boss, and I'm just hoping, hoping, hoping that it's better than the last one she did with her husband, Tammy, which I hated. And a very strange film with Jake Gyllenhaal called Demolition. Next week, I'll tell you all about it. What film doesn't he do that you have to describe it as a very odd film? <laughs> <laughs> he does go for the strange. He does. he does go for the very, very strange. Well, you are not strange, movie mom. You are a fan... Fantastic. Aw, love you guys. Love you. If you want to catch this interview, it's up at our website, WJBQ.com, where we always have a link to MovieMom.com. Have a great weekend, Movie Mom. Bye-bye.